Hey everyone, this is Max, owner of Logo. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you a new product we have coming out, the Logo Expressive Elf Ears Bento Edition. So you may be familiar with our old Expressive Elf Ears, and they worked with our older heads, and they had a number of different poses, uh, like up or down, sad, kind of pointed up happy, uh, that uh, synced with the expressions for the heads. So these are similar, and in fact, if you're looking at them and you're familiar with the other ones, they don't look any different off the bat, but these are bento. So what does that mean? So first of all, it means that they will respond to the ear sliders, and I'll show that off in a little bit. Uh, but more importantly, if you have a logo head, every single animation uh, that we sell, all the motion capture animations, have been redone, and they now come with a, a version of the animation that includes... Uh, custom made or custom animated ear motions. So just to give you an example, um, if I take this happy expression number 24 here, and if you watch your ears, so you can see as she moves, her ears react naturally to what her face is doing. So to get these working, what you do is you need to get an update of whatever animations you have. And if you look inside the bag, you will notice that there is now a version with an E in it. So let's take a look at the oh my god expression first without the ear motion so you can see the difference. So obviously the ears move with the head but the ears themselves are motionless. So let's install that same pack. And even if you already have them installed, if you're using the installer with the ear versions, it'll overwrite whichever ones you have installed already. All right, so those are done. And now let's look at the same animation again. So you can see the ears jiggle when she's shaking her head and the movements match the facial movements. So for the same thing, for the default 12 expressions that come with all the heads, if you look inside the bags of the last update, you'll notice that there is a new installer. This one right here, this one's Alexis defaults with ears. So if I click that and click the installer, this is basically gonna go in and, and replace all 12 original expressions with ones that have ear motions. And if you need to go back, there's an installer to, to install the old versions again. So now all the default animations have an ear motion attached. So let's go through some of these. A lot of them are pretty subtle. I didn't want to go too crazy with a lot of them. I wanted them to feel natural. So like there, as she kind of turns her head, they just kind of go back a little bit. Uh, actually, I'll skip ahead. This one's kind of my favorite one. So the other thing is the ears have different styles as well. So let's look at the customization HUD. So there's two different sizes included and each has basically four different configurations that you can use. So these kind of put the ears back and up, which is a style that some people prefer. These are straight out and then these are uh, out and then back. And then there's a smaller version as well. So as I said earlier, these also respond to the shape sliders. So I made a shape with the ear tips pulled out. And when you do that, you get a style like this, which is closer to like a World of Warcraft elf or whatever. But all the expressions still work the same, regardless of the ear shape.
and I'm just going to put her original shape back on. And um, it's probably default. Okay. And the other thing that's included is uh, basically just an ear, uh, an ear AO if you want to just leave that running all the time. And so that has just a few movements of the ears by themselves. And every few seconds, they'll just kind of move around a little bit. And that works really well if you have another uh, face AO running at the same time. They kind of work together, just give your character a lot of life. That's it. Thanks very much.